Uh, Congress has decided, I guess uh, uh, a committee in the House of Representatives has this authority, ha has decided uh, to release uh, Donald Trump's tax records to the public. They're going to be uh, redacted, so there'll be different personal items will be uh, uh, blocked out, but, but we'll get to see the actual numbers uh, after people have been very curious. This is after the Supreme Court um, said that it was uh, that the IRS um, had to uh, hand over the records to, um, to Congress, to this com subcommittee in Congress. I don't know if the Supreme Court had in mind that these would be made public, but I assume it, it did because, uh, uh, you know, there's no reason once Congress has access to these records that they're not available to all to, to, to everybody. Uh, you know, it, it's, it's, it is interesting that Congress has the ability to take an individual, now granted he was president, tax records and just, and just make them public. I don't know what I think about that. I, 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 it, it doesn't seem completely right. On the other hand, um, Donald Trump was president, is running for president. Things like tax records should be something that we see as, as part of our decision to vote for him or not. It'll be interesting, I think, to see what the tax records say about uh, Trump, I, you know, the fact that he'll have a bunch of deductions to try to avoid taxes, I think, is a virtue, not a vice. Uh, but it will be interesting to see uh, how much income he actually is reporting. Uh, you know, we've already seen that the Trump businesses were found guilty of fraud on 17 different counts of fraud. So we know the business has, has been doing all kinds of things to finagling in order to minimize taxes and in order to get the best loan conditions out of the banks possible, uh, defrauding both the tax authorities and the banks in the process. Um, but it, it'll be interesting to see what Trump has been doing with his taxes and, and kind of the, the source uh, for some of the money uh, flowing in. So um, we'll see. It, 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 it is going to be interesting. Um, it is going to be interesting to see what's on those, I'm sure, more will be made of it that is justified, particularly this will be a good opportunity for Republicans to make all kinds of accusations about the rich and how the rich don't pay taxes, nonsense like that. Of course, this system of deductions, this system of, uh, of loopholes is a system created by Congress. If Congress wants to fix it, they can easily fix it. Uh, I would say the easiest way to fix it, the best way to fix it, flat tax, no deductions, no exclusions, nothing. Just everybody pay everybody, but everybody, that would include everybody, would pay, you know, 15% of income, uh, ideally 5% of income, but let's say for now 15% of income slowly going down to 5, to five over the next, uh, let's start with 15, just 15 flat tax, no deductions, no exclusions, and everybody pays, so that'll increase the tax base, and it would reduce the ability of, of, of people to hire tax accountants to uh, uh, screw with the system. It would also, it would also force tax accountants to actually engage in uh, uh, economic value-added activities uh, versus right now they're basically engaged in kind of zero-sum activities. I still value them a huge amount, but simplifying taxes would uh, making them really, really easy. What was a Steve Forbes idea? Postcard. You'd fill out a postcard, and that was it. That would be your taxes. That is. One of the best, easiest ways to collapse the bureaucracy and, and, and simplify our lives and, and reduce government involvement in our lives, just, just postcard taxes. Uh, and if you did that for corporations as well, corporate tax, flat tax at 10, 15 percent, no exclusions, no deductions, no nothing. Um, you'd have to work it out. You'd have to figure it out exactly, but I, I think it really is doable. And um, yeah, and, and, and I, think, I think life would be, we would be a lot freer under a system like that. So if, if Congress really cared, that's what they would do. Anyway, Trump taxes, going to be made public. Uh, you'll, you'll see a lot of that in the press. You'll see a lot of commentators, and you'll see the left try to make as much of it as they can. Uh, they'll try to make hay of it uh, to the extent that they can. Thank you for listening or watching The Iran Brooks Show. If you'd like to support the show, 
we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to yourownbookshow.com slash support, by going to Patreon, subscribe star, locals, and just making a appropriate contribution uh, on any one, of those, uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see the Your Own Book Show grow, please consider sharing our content and, of course, subscribe. Press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for you, those of you who are already subscribers and those of you who are already supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.